Hey guys, Drew back here with you on Z Code System. And today, as you can see right in front of you, we're talking about the NBA 2022 2023 season, which tips off in just under a month. So, a lot of things getting going here with the NBA as we get prepared for that. And of course, you can always go over to Z Code Systems once the season starts or in preseason, and you can get the latest systems and betting predictions and betting picks for the NBA this upcoming 2022-2023 season. As we all know, the Golden State Warriors won the NBA Finals last season, beating the Boston Celtics in six games. And the Warriors will be favored by many to go back and win the title once more. Celtics also are seen as one of the favorites as well going into the new season, going into the preseason, which is upcoming. And sports books uh, liking both of those teams' chances of making it to the finals, winning the finals, uh, this upcoming season. So we're talking about the NBA as it tips off soon in October, and we're going to run down the dates. And as I talk to you today on Tuesday, September the 27th, 2022, the NBA training camps begin. Yes, that's right. Today, the NBA training camps, training camps are beginning as uh, we get prepared for the upcoming season. And do you know what? It's only three days until the preseason begins. So the preseason will begin on September the 30th. So that's just three days from now. And you will be able to go over to Z Code System to get the latest uh, betting picks and predictions for those games in the preseason. And the preseason is always a great time to make your picks and to get uh, in on the action to, to hone your craft for the upcoming season, just as the way that the NBA teams will be uh, playing and training in training camp and in preseason, well, you have the preseason to hone your craft and get your your betting strategies uh, sorted, get them get them going for the upcoming season. Now, we're going to talk about the odds here in a second for the uh, the outright winner odds of the for the NBA title this upcoming uh, campaign. But before we do that, let's run down a few of the key dates to keep in mind. Now, of course, you can just read the blog there at zcodesystem.com backslash blog, and it will give you all these dates, plus a lot more info. I uh, covered some info on the Boston Celtics and the Golden State Warriors when I wrote this up. So go over there, read that, and you'll get uh, even more than what you're going to get here in the video as we talk mostly about the betting odds coming up. But as I said before today, the training camps begin on the 27th, and in three days, preseason begins. October the 14th, preseason will, will finish up and we will tip off the regular season on October 18th with really two fantastic games. You got the Warriors and the Lakers going at it in the Western Conference and the Philadelphia 76ers and the Boston Celtics going at it in the Eastern Conference. So that first night is going to be absolutely outstanding for NBA fans and NBA betters. Now, once we get to February, February 17th to the 22nd is going to be the NBA All-Star break. And then we get to April the 9th when the NBA's regular season finishes up. And then we have the, I guess it's what a two month long postseason uh, as we will then kick off or tip off, I should say, the NBA play-in tournament on out April the 11th. Again, the play-in tournament has returned or will return. Uh, a lot of people really enjoy that. I'm not such a big fan of it, but that's just me. Uh, and then the NBA playoffs proper will begin on April the, fir April the 15th, 2023 with the finals starting June the 1st. Now, if the NBA Finals go to a seventh game, that will be played on June the 18th, if necessary, 2023, June the 18th, 2023. So those are the key dates. Again, you can go over to the blog, read up on the, the key dates there uh, if you missed anything. And uh, there are a few other key important uh, dates uh, that, that I did not mention that you can read about there in the blog. But let's look over at Bet365, my favorite online betting sports book where we're going to look at the futures odds for the NBA champion coming up in 2022-2023. And if you use Bet365, uh, of course, there are other sports books out there. That's just my favorite, and I use that uh, quite often, especially in these videos. Uh, you can see there we've got some different matchups from uh, European uh, basketball that's going on right now. So if you're into European basketball or basketball betting, check out those games uh, that are happening uh, today or, or over the next couple of days. And as you can see, uh, I'm just going to click on the futures there. We've got a whole host of different basketball leagues going on. Of course, the NBA seen as the, the biggest league, the best league in the world. But we've also got the, NBA, um, the NCAA basketball championships going on this season, the Euro League, Euro Cup, 
Australia, France, blah, blah, blah. We've got lots of different leagues going on, and you can scroll down. You can see the top leagues there going on in Europe, as well as, like I said before, Australia, and you've got Japan uh, there as well. But, of course, for this video, we're looking at the NBA futures, and we've got several markets already, the seven markets right there, to win outright, to win the conference, to win the division, regular season MVP, team to make the NBA playoffs, regular season wins, and regular season awards. So if you are an NBA better, you might want to have a look at these over the next few days before these uh, odds change uh, and perhaps these, these markets close out uh, once the season tips off. So you don't want to check these out, uh, especially if you are a big time NBA better. So let's go into this here. We've got our futures betting odds, and you can see there we've got uh, just a few teams, so we're going to expand that. And as you can see, Bet365 is offering uh, half the odds for places each way if the teams make it to the finals. So, of course, the NBA championships, this all includes the playoffs. And we've got the Golden State Warriors at plus 600 to win the NBA Finals. Now, I was actually searching through uh, a couple of uh, different sources uh, for for our blog today and our video, and the Boston Celtics just a few weeks ago were considered the, the favorite by sportsbooks to win the NBA title. Now, that's changed because, as we all know, uh, their head coach has been suspended for the upcoming season, all the season, uh, due to some code of conduct uh, breaches there, and uh, the Celtics will have Joel Mazzula um, taking over as interim coach this season. So I believe that has seen them, uh, or led to them, dropping in the odds slightly and putting the Warriors back on top there. Now, the Warriors uh, were initially seen by a lot of sports books as a team that uh, didn't do enough work in the offseason. They, they lost a couple of important players. Um, uh, Otto Porter and uh, Gary Payton II. And so sportsbooks didn't necessarily like the the fact that those players left and that uh, some potentially not quite adequate uh, replacements were brought in. So the Warriors were initially not necessarily seen as the favorite, but they've, they've recovered that uh, thanks to, uh, in no small part, to the Celtics uh, coaches, coach being suspended. So uh, the Warriors now going in as the favorite. And as we can see there, uh, the longest odds uh, belong to the Rockets, Pistons, Spurs, Magic, and the Sacramento Kings. So, uh, you know, despite moving on into the 2022-2023 season, uh, not a lot changes for teams such as the Kings or the Magic. Um, Warriors, you know, I, you can't really go against the Warriors. They've won the NBA title, I believe it's eight times since 2020, uh, since 2015, eight times since 2015. So that is uh, unbelievable. Uh, Steph Curry, still the best player in the NBA, though a lot of people will look at LeBron James and the Lakers and uh, as being the, the best team there in the NBA. Um, I don't think you can really look past the Warriors, even though they did lose uh, a couple of players in the offseason, in, in Porter and Payton. Uh, even though they brought in players who may not be necessarily at the same level, the Warriors probably have enough to, as long as Curry stays fit, to to get to the final once more. Whether they win it there it will remain to be seen uh, once we get to the season, once we get the season going. Of course, the Bucks will be good with Giannis uh, playing there. But, uh, you know, I really like those first three teams in odds, the Warriors, the Bucks, and the Celtics. And, you know, it's going to be really difficult for any of those other NBA rivals to to contend for the title. Uh, now, the Lakers will be will be good from time to time with, with LeBron, although he is, of course, aging. Uh, and, you know, the Clippers are a bit of a wild card, as well as the 76ers in Heat. So those are the odds for the upcoming NBA season. I like the Warriors at the moment. I'm, of course, in a Boston Celtics fan, grew up a Boston Celtics fan. Uh, but I think the Warriors are just going to be too strong at the moment. Because Steph Curry is the best player in the NBA at the moment, uh, even though Gian Giannis gives him a, a strong run for his money. But I'm picking the Warriors at the moment to win the NBA Finals uh, for another, I guess it would be the ninth time since 2015. So that's who uh, I'm looking at right now to win the Finals. Uh, but let me know what you think about the NBA upcoming season down in the comments below and who you think will win the NBA championship this season. And of course, always, guys, please hit that thumbs up button and like this video and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already so you can stay up to date on all the videos we post here on Z Code System. And that way you can make smart, educated sports betting picks. 
all season long. All right, guys, thanks for watching. I'm Drew, and I appreciate you watching. And go over and check out the blog that we posted there today, and I will see you soon here on Z Code System.